hello friends my name is Aarti Sharma and in this video tutorial we are going to talk about haploid and diploid organisms so let's get started so first of all haploid organisms why they are known as haploid so haploid stands for single set of chromosomes so the cells which contain single set of chromosomes means they carry single copy of each chromosomes are known as haploid organisms so like in case of human beings we have our sex cells we have ovum and sperms in case of males and ovum in case of female so these sex cell contain 23 number of chromosomes means we have 23 pairs of chromosomes but in our sex cells they contain single copy of each chromosomes like this is the single copy of chromosome number one chromosome number two chromosome number three four five up to 23rd chromosome number so the organisms with single set of or single copy of chromosomes are known as haploid organisms so next are uh, diploid organisms the organisms which contain two sets of chromosomes like we are diploid organism di means two ploid means set of chromosomes so we have two sets of chromosomes like we have 23 pairs of chromosomes 22 are autosomes and the two chromosomes are sex chromosomes means one pair of chromosomes are known as sex chromosomes so next is our structures of chromosome like this is the single chromosome or single chromatid this is another single chromatid when these two chromatids combine they form a pair of chromosomes like this is chromosome number one pair of chromosome number one and these two are known as sister chromatids so next is polyploidy poly means so many ploidy means set of chromosomes when the cell contain more than two sets of chromosomes like in case of banana the bananas are triploid why because each chromosome of banana contain three sets of chromosomes in case of wheat they are tetraploid like each chromosome of the wheat contain four copies of four copies so they are tetraploid in the same manner the organism may be pentaploid hexaploid heptaploid and the higher levels are known as polyploidy so here is the sample diagram of the chromosomes first one is haploid means orange one is single chromosome purple one is single and the yellow one is another chromosome so chromosomes are present with single copies in diploid they are present in double copies in triploid the three copies of each chromosome is present and in tetraploid four copies of each chromosomes are present so if you like my lecture please subscribe my channel and thank you